My name is Song Hun Jung. I work for the Department of Geography Education, the College of Education at Kangwon National University. Um, I would like to introduce briefly the, about my academic background. I did BA and MA in Dongguk uh, University in Korea. And after that, the, I moved to the University of Sussex at Brighton in the UK. Uh, there, I did an MA uh, in economic geography. And then I also did, did the a PhD, the field in the, the UK term and uh, in Sussex European Institute in the same university in the UK. So also, the, I'm a, the professor and uh, I'm a president of the Economic Geographical Society of Korea. I was the dean of the College of Education, Gangwon National University. And I was president of the University Industry, Industry Cooperation Foundation, Gangwon National University, and so on. Yeah, in this lecture, I actually they focused upon the regional development uh, the, in the context of policies on balanced national development by the Korean government. And secondly, I they concentrate on the policy and activities on industrial complexes. And finally, also policy and activities on techno parks and other parks for the regional innovation system. Yeah, I'm going to show you the, this is special, uh, special policy and development for small and medium sized enterprise through policies and activities on industrial complex and techno parks. I mainly focused upon the um, industrial complex and techno parks for the, the industrial innovative cluster and the regional innovation system, along with context of the development of small and medium sized enterprise. I'm going to share the in a minute. Yeah, we, we, we have got the different the world, the different the era. The, I mean, uh, many, I actually want to call the new era of the COVID-19. The, uh, so welcome to Virtual Korea and enjoy this the online message and enjoy the moment. Please solve an, an even regional development in your country. That's it. Today, I'm going to talk about policies on the balanced national development and the regional innovation system in Korea. Uh, you can understand the balanced national development. It means the government intervened into the regional development to solve the gap between regions in the context of economy and society. So this is Korean system. Firstly, focused upon the the balanced the national development in Korea. Right? Yeah, during the Korean War, we yeah, we the Korea had got this you know this uh, tragedy between the North and South Korea. Um, so it's. Um, and then just like this, the, as, at that time, the situation was quite terrible. However, since the 1960s, we actually, Korean government selected the strategy of the expert the industrialization. And then this graph, the actually show you the, the regime of a pre, uh, presidential regime has, has got different targets and different strategies. The red, the red one is the um, the real GDP growth rate, and then the blue one is GDP per capita. So, in terms of this graph, we started the 1960s, and then th along with the export industrialization, and then even though real growth GDP growth rate quite, you know, the uh, quite. Uh, how can I say, quite uh, fluctuated, but the GDP per capita is steadily, sometimes very rapidly, the, the increases. Up to the um, 1980s, the, we, the real GDP growth rate sharply decreased due to the Korean the political turbulence because of the death of the uh, President Jong Hee Park. He actually the 
strongly to take Korea, uh, took the Korean economy out to the export industrialization, and uh, and then sharply the uh, drop down, and then sharply the increases. At this time, the world economy actually the crisis of Fordism, the you know, uh, on the global scale. And after the uh, one year, one year late, after one year late, the sharply the increases just and then fluctuate. Another second, the crisis of the Korean economy is in the IMF bailout. This, which means the uh, Asian financial crisis in the late 1990s. And then after one year, it's also the Korean economy recover sharply. And then just like this, and then the in the um, Year, uh, 2000, to year 2009, we also had a subprime mortgage, mortgage crisis. But this time also Korean economy de- recovered the recovered sharply de- uh, just during, during one year. That's Korean economy, the, you know, outlook, economy, the characteristics. Yeah. Now then, I'm going to show you the Korean economy since 1960s along with the strategy on industrialization. Now, see, during 1960s and 70s, so we took primary industry and then take, take to the right industry and right in heavy chemical industry and an industrial rip, and which means the, we actually the, took the strategy on heavy chemical industry. And then the year 2000, since the 2000, we also did sharply the, uh, take the high tech and the heavy industry as well. Currently, we've got strong, strong high tech and ICT information and communication technology. This is Korean the economic the, the trajectory in terms of industrial the, uh, development. Right. This figure very important. The important things is just like this area. What is this area? Manufacturing. Since 1960s, actually the Korea has got the share of the total value added. The manufacturing share is 30% around, around 30%. Very strong, very strong the power, the economic power along the um, different the industrial sectors. That is merit. Korean the e- economy actually the e- merit. Most the advanced country, most industrialized country actually the, e- tend to lose the percent of value added in manufacturing sector. But Korea, we still steady keep the manufacturing sector ar- around 30 percent. Is this is Korean strong the e- power? of the uh, world economy. Right. This manufacturing setup and R&D the expenditure the actually correlation. You know, this x-axis, the R&D expenditure of manufacturing, and then this, the uh, vertical axis, the uh, total value added of the manufacturing. Actually, the, uh, these two variables, correlations, up to two, year 2009 and up to current the year, two, uh, year uh, 2018. That's the main point the, for the, the Korean economic development. Right. However, 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 we, we have got uneven regional development. Most the uh, most of the, uh, the other country, yeah, Korean has got sustainable economic growth. This is uh, totally different from the other developing countries. But, but within the Korean, within the Korea, we have uh, uneven regional development. Also, we have uh, uneven social development. That's Korean problem. Sustain, sustainable economic growth with uneven regional development. This is paradoxical one. Right? 
you you have got five different the grand region. I mean, we called this uh, someone called the mega region, but uh, no, no, academically no, just grand, just the uh, how can I say just just the um, great regions. The first red one, uh, the blue one, is the Seoul metropolitan area, including Seoul and then Gyeonggi province and an Incheon city. Red one is the Yongnam region. Another, the axis, another core of for industrial development in South Korea, and a Hunan region and a Chungcheong region, just like that. But you can also carefully watch out this gap. This gap between the Seoul metropolitan area and the other regions. Even the government intervened this problem with uneven regional development. The government intervened, government investment to solve this the uneven regional development. And then still we have got why the gap of the A between different regions. That's Korean problems. Also the I focused upon is the the phenomenon. Right. Now then, I'm going to show you different government how to try to solve this the uneven regional development. Start with the No Muhyun regime, No Muhyun government, uh, that we normally call the participatory government. Actually, the, the no, present No Muhyun is very, in my in my view, in my view, in my view, very the, the prominent the president. Uh, he actually tried to solve between solve the gap between different regions. Mainly, mostly before No Mu Hyun regime, mostly Korean politicians focused upon Honam regions versus Yongnam regions. Not economically, this tension is between Honam and Yongnam more they focused upon, more based on the political tensions. After No Mu Hyun, after No Mu Hyun, he actually, wait a minute, uh, he actually think about, not this, not this. He, he looked at Seoul metropolitan area and then the other areas. So he tried to concentrate on on this gap between Seoul metropolitan area and the other areas. That's different the system from former president. So he actually investment he actually investment except Seoul metropolitan area. He actually investment in these regions. Thus he made lots of lots of policies, main engines, main engines for the Korean economic social regional development. He actually took the the policy tool, which means the regional innovation system and industrial clusters. Very important things in Korean regional development. He also he also He also looking at which regions basically is very poor in this country. That's this this other regions, these regions, these regions, these regions, this the cross border regions. And then he specialized the, you know the uh, specialized the policy the in, for the this regional development as well. So he normally called the new projection and original revitalization. It's a one of the one of the projects, one of the project, the most no whole things, and he made one of the strong engines, engines means innovation city, innovation city. Actually, he make 
outside outside of the is the Seoul metropolitan area. He make he tried to make tried to make ten innovation city. Why this? Why doing this? Actually, this this concentrate the you know every functions, forms, and banking system and public institutions into the other area. This is the, the concentration policy. The concentration policy. Not the centralized policy. Just like devolu devolution in the UK. This is the concentration policy. Yeah, this is uh, you have to de memorize, not decentralized policy, just the decentral the concentrate the different functions, forms, and and, and uh, public institutions into spread the different area. That is the main engine for uneven to solve uneven regional development by normal Hyun, present normal Hyun. I mean, absolutely fantastic. Now then, after Dong Hui Hyun, Yi Myung Bak regime, he tried to make the definition, define different Korea regions, just grouping five. That is kind of what we, we normally call the mega city regions policy. And then five mega city, mega city region, mega city, non mega city, mega city region, and then two specialized the, the the regions. So we normally call the five or two the, uh, regional policy at that time. And then he tried strategy different what different the uh, strategies. One the, for example, the first the strategy differentiated in a unique development in the local authorities. And then second the strategy building up of a life of the human settlement. Third the strategy improvement of quality of life in peripheral regions. Just just like just like the uh, just like the normal Hyun regime, but different one is the um, he tried to divide the five the uh, mega city regions in uh, two special regions. Is that is different point? And uh, after Myeongbang Lee, Lee Myeongbak, President Lee Myeongbak, and then we we had the uh, President Park Geun Hye. He tried to make in local area for happy life, and then he. He actually, she actually concentrate on very the you know local areas and you know, something like the something like UK the policy not not exactly same as UK policy something like UK policy local enterprise partnership different local area combined together and then suggest a project and then central government select one of project the on the basis of the how can I say survival game. So the, this is a kind kind of the uh, how can I say neoliberalist policy by the UK government. Not this one exactly. However, the present park actually the group of small the uh, local areas, and then invest in government invest in different uh, targets. This is an urban rural linkage the the uh, project. This one is the um, how can I, ah yeah. You, you, the cent, you center for the, um, the growth, uh, you center growth area. And then also the, he, she invests in the agriculture and fishery, the uh, area. That's his main areas. And then targeting local area. Uh, for happy life, I don't know. Happy life, what is happy life? Anyway, happy life. Um, yeah. Now then. After after President Park, the, we have we have the current government is Moon Moon Jae In. Moon Jae In regime is an, actually the three different targets. Uh, one is human. Means people. Target police target on a human. Second, liable space. He he actually the focus upon space. And then industry, industry for regional innovation with with job creation. This is Moon, current the uh, government the uh, policy for the uh, regional development. 
human is different. When I looked at when I looked at the um, the UK government and other other countries other countries government the paper, there after twenty first uh, after since twenty first century, uh, I mean not the, more exactly since the beginning of the twenty first century, most government most advanced countries government they focus upon people. In Korea, same as just like this, people is. People are much more important for the um, making policy for the um, national and the regional development. And this government, thinking about the people, also uh, this government, the very, very, very easily divide the focus to space. What space? Liveable space. This liveable space origina originated from the American government in 1998. Um, so, uh, and at that time, thus the American notion of liveable space uh, spread, dispersed into the uh, other countries. Or we too, this one, this one, no now, no now, the before before this government and then this government concentrate on liveable space and regional innovation. She said, they say regional innovation. Regional innovation basically the supply side of the economy rather than demand side of the economy. I mean, uh, demand side of the economy such as the house, the care of take, care, taking care of household economy and then the personal economy and so on. But we together is job creation, which means the combined supply side economy and demand side economy to create a job, to secure a job, just like this. So, this government, government the policy characterized the human space regional innovation uh, system with the job creation. This is Korean government, the uh, government history about to solve uneven regional development. Uh, and then uh, with uh, the care of the uh, regional the, uh, development. Now then. I'm going to I'm going to show you an example case study, the, which is the the Korean DMG Peace Geo Park project, actually the funded by Presidential Advisory Committee on the Balanced National Development. Um, I have got uh, I haven't got enough time, but I'll show you the very briefly. This is one of the case study. Korean government project to solve the regional, you know, uneven, uh, uneven regional development. I actually did, did this project as a uh, deputy uh, manager. So uh, I'm going to de explain and show you the how actually this manager to, you know, deal deal with and then the, this keep going. Right? Yeah. Introduction. You know DMG. DMG, yeah, actually demilitarized zone. Actually, we actually focus upon demilitarized zone itself. We we can't go there. We can't go there. So, demilitarized zone and its adjacent area, cross border region. This is our target for the regional development. Actually, the this one is the uh, you know spread the uh, actually the located from. Incheon through Gyeonggi and then up to Gangwon province. They have a comprehensive and academic geoscientific size, site. This geoscientific site is very important for what? For, for what? For geopark. I'm going to show you later in a minute. Also, their historical asset and cultural uniqueness and the ecological resources which have still remained intact and unexplored due to the Korean War in the early 1950s and the tension between the South and North during about 60 years. This project on establishing the DMG Peace Geo Park was launched by central government, Gangwon province and local authorities. Uh, identity, historical background, it's a very important thing. DMG was formed in July 1953 and when the Chinese, 
Chinese and North Koreans and the UN commanders signed actually the Korean armistice agreement, which meant a ceasefire of the Korean War. Actually, the DMG is a zone that is that is stepped back about two kilometers from MDL. MDL is a military demarcation line. This red line is. Uh, I'm sorry. All right. Yeah, this is is a red line. You you have got the red line. This is MDL. You know, about two, kilo, two kilometers from MDL towards each direction, north and south, direction of the uh, south and north. In addition, the length of MDL is about 238 kilometers. It's normally with 148 miles. Right. This is cross border region between north and south, right? And a fantastic view. This is geopark, the geosite. Each geosite is um, the actually geo means land. Park geo means land. Park means the geomorphological, geological site together and then making park and then you know show the tourism and then show the tourism and then improve the regional development through the geo park project. We take the DMG and its each adjacent area is a piece. We call the piece geopark. So this area is just like this. A fantastic view. Right. And a poor region. Population. Population is very low. Not innovation cities is the uh, wrong time. Uh, this is a peripheral area in Korea. Even though this peripheral area, so the Actually, the GDP level, GDP level, just just like that, just like that. low, low, low job, low GDP equilibrium, something like that. That's a typical peripheral area, and not exactly a typical peripheral. The economically, the just like this, but this area is quite stable. Right, and then symbol of the DMG Geo Park, just like that. We we actually, we actually, we actually divide the three different group, and land by volcanic activity, and land by running water, land by wave. So we, you know, found found geo site twenty. 22 core geological and geomorphological geosite. We made them. We make them. We made them. All right. And then we 43 ecological, historical, cultural geosite. The value value is very important. Actually, the important value such as the first things the, the Korean war-related geosite first. Second value, world unique ecosystem ecological landscape due to the Korean War. Third value, diverse distribution of historical and cultural resources from the prehistoric to modern times. This, I, mean, I mean, I think this is main value of the, the Korean, of the MG, the Peace Japan. Ryan, I'm going to show you each scientific characteristics of the DMG Japan. James actually focused upon Gangwon province, has geomorphological and geological resources, which are represented as a process of the formation of the Korean Peninsula. Right, this is uh, the first example, the landform created by volcanic activities, Choron, we call it in Korean, Gosokjong. Uh, Fantastic view, but the term, terminology is very, you know, Unfamiliar with you, this is a geological and a geomorphological, the, uh, the academic term. The bedrock of this area is granite. You know granite? Uh, I can explain granite. It's very, uh, very difficult to explain the, uh, you know, the uh, and a rock, uh, name, name of a rock. In the, uh, in the Mesozoic, 
And in the quaternary lava flow, lava flow actually the, in, into this region by the fissure eruption. After this, basalt was removed by the stream erosion, uh, and then the sunk granite was exposed, just like this, on the surface. So, Chorongun is one of the most important geosites in understanding geomorphology and geology, just like this. Yeah, I mean, fantastic. I, actually, this one is the you know lava flow and basalt loving the Hantan River through the Hantan River, and also the um, this is the uh, lava plateau, you know lava plateau. Uh, actually, on this surface, the, there are agricultural activities here, and the the, the how can I say rice rice, uh, Korean rice is very the famous from these regions. Right, this is the Choron Lava Plateau. Uh, it, it's a shame, it's a shame, it's a shame. Uh, because of the, this, uh, the COVID-19. So if not, I would like to invite you and uh, into the, this region and explain this region just like this. It's a fantastic view. Right, second, one, second example, land form created by running water, running water. The Yangi there, you can you can go there. I we can't go there. We can't go there. We can go there. We could go there. The during this project, the permission under the permission of the government, Yangi there is just stream wetland, stream wetland, just like this, which formed by change of fluvial sedimentary circumstances and the constitution of two dams, and each side cross into Korean border. As entrance into this site has been have been prohibited, right, rigidly, right, for about sixty years. So, paradoxically, this ecosystem of Yangi there recovered itself from ruin of the Korean War. Yeah, this product is by the Korean War. Yeah. More specifically, the, the by the by uh, by. Uh, made by, I'm sorry, made by the, the tension between North and South, just like this. So just like the constitution, just Ryang there. A fantastic view. Attack, intact. Nobody can go there. Nobody cannot mm, go there. Right, this one is a land created by running water, running water, all right? What is it? Dutayan, Yanggu, the plunge pool. Dutayan is a plunge pool under waterfall, waterfall just like this, I'm sorry, which is formed by meander cutting, you know, and it's a geomorphological term. This plunge pool always has cold and unpolluted, unpolluted water, and so it is famous for the habitat of Lenok, one of natural movement in Korea. It's a fantastic one. All right. This is geomorphological ge geological site. This we normally call the geosite. Geosite. The important thing with the geosite, the people, local people, have to have to build the software infrastructure. Also, educate the local people is important. We actually did this project. The first of all, we try to support the make establish the legislation of local regulation, local regulation for DMG Peace Geopark. This is many, many things. We persuade actually local government, Gangwon province, provincial government, also the the mayor mayors of these local the areas, and then together we you know we actually mix together. We meet together and we establish the legislation of a local regulation for the peace geopark. This is a very important, the, how can I say, product, outcome for this project, for the, the, for the regional development. Secondly, we actually hear, heard local people. What local people really want? How the local people, you know, to participate in this project? The public hearing 
its important things. Thirdly, we made the different information activities and make just like digital the information board. And then also we made the DMG e-learning center through the, this project. Also offline information board as well. So the academia the, take this project and just the provide the lots of, lots of content into the, um, the, this, the consulting firms and so on. So we made this one. So the lead important thing is educating local people, first. Eh? Second, educating school teachers. Thirdly, educating children. This is the type of contribution to local development and regional development by in a grand project. Right? This is the uh, evidence, the educating school teachers. Right? Also, we need interpreters for the Geotourism. Geotourism we very important things. So we educating, re-educating the local interpreters. This is contribute the clear explain the geosite for tourists, for local people, for teachers and children. I'm not think that this one is the, the you know package of regional development, package of local development programs. You know, if we want the regional development, there are the various various directions for the regional development. First one is the you know invest in the industrial site and attraction firms, attraction firms, and support firms, also the we actually government the, you know intervene that's kind of the the firms activity industrial activities this this is the one way to the regional development the other way to the regional development we take the you know you ta we we take the geosite and then we collect different level of different level of the resources also we collect different people teachers, tourists, interpreters, children, local people, and so on. This, this is the other type, type of a regional development. This case, Geo Park case, just like the, the latter one for the regional development to solve uneven regional development. Right, finally we just together, we just together, and then we the establish this kind of institution Institutions, that's geotourism, community business, and regional development, just like this. Yeah, manageable geotourism. We think about geotourism, and then we make the, you know, commo commercial activities. I mean, commodities, that's a geotourism, example of geotourism, the commodities. And then this, the physical landscape, also food, local food, local restaurants. The local, you know, the uh, agricultural resources. We together and we made, we turn, turn into what? Turn into what? Geotourism commodities. And we, we have got just like these kind of institutions. I mean, community business center, the actually manage Gangwon DMG Geo Park project. That is a final institutions, just like this. Conclusions. For the, this project, the Korean DMG Peace Geo Park is a geo scientific and cultural historical value. The DMG or the DMGs are the adjacent areas and unique heritage of Cold War of the world. While preparing but being geo global geo park project, we attempt to make an effort. The firstly, to melt its geo scientific characteristics into local embedded cultural and historical heritages. 
to educate the local residents, and to revitalize the local economy along with the geopark concept. That is the case of case study of the geopark project for the um, regional development funded by uh, balanced national development, actually presidential advisory presidential presidential, presidential committee on balanced national development. Right, quiz. I have very simple, very easy. You can try. You can try. Yeah. I mean, I think you, 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 I expect you will correct the answer, right? Thank you very much. Yeah. That's it.